Sports Edition of the NBA. This is Kevin Harlan with Greg Anthony and Clark Kellogg and our sideline reporter David Aldridge. We've got the Milwaukee Bucks facing the West All-Stars. Here are the starters for Milwaukee. Middleton, the small forward, with Giannis Antetokounmpo as the power forward. Holiday and Allen have guard duties, and it's Lopez in at the five. And out of bounds as the Bucks gain possession. Jaron Jackson's checked in for the West. Morant comes in for Curry. And it's Antetokounmpo with the ball. He'll bring it up for Milwaukee. Nobody near Allen. No good on the three. And they had some botched coverage that turned into no coverage. And here's Doncic from the arc. Good, and the assist goes to Jokic. Boy, the passing ability of Jokic is really something. I mean, he's proven to be quite the capable playmaker. To the middle, here's Allen. And boy, that looked like Bolton. And yes, it is, and so they will award the basket there. Almost got there in time, but waited just a little too long. 112 left here in the first quarter. Back to Doncic. Outside Jackson. LeBron outside. Puts one up from 19. It's a hand on it. Jokic on the follow. You know, when Jokic gets his hands on an offensive rebound, it's too late to try to stop him. He doesn't waste too many second chance opportunities. good some solid defense there from Jackson from deep three-point range and it's out of bounds last touch by Moran so an almost entirely new group now for the West Sabonis he's checked in for Jokic Markinen comes in for Jaron Jackson George is checked in for James and Shea Gilgis Alexander subbed in for Luka Doncic and then for Milwaukee Joe Ingles is checked in for Chris Middleton. Pat Connaughton comes in for Grayson Allen. And it's Carter in for Drew Holiday. And the call on the shot that sends him to the line. A multiple-time MVP. You know, what's really scary is that Giannis feels like he can keep getting better. And more importantly, he does the work to get better. Free throw is good. Lillard's checked in for the West. He hits both from the strike. First quarter, about a minute and a half in. That one misses. And Milwaukee the other way now. 23 seconds left in the first. Down it goes. Nice one there from Antetokounmpo. And Antetokounmpo showing his versatility yet again. His dribble moves are virtually unguardable. Here's Sabonis. No one on him. And he makes the easy one. Guys, that's just really unstoppable. He poses a ton of matchup problems for whomever he's facing. And that one's good out of the Kumbo. Giannis has got six points. Boy, the added work in the weight room for Giannis coming into play there. I mean, you got to send an army to try to stop this guy. And once he got to the 10, I think he was surprised to find himself that wide open. Well, this early, they should be showing a lot more energy on defense. It's not there. At the end of one, a closely contested game so far. West All-Stars lead by one. And the second quarter will be on the way when we come back. And some good action in the books as we get back to the game that's been pretty close here so far. 
And from what we've seen from the West All-Stars, what's your jinx so far? Well, when you control the glass, you control the second chance opportunities on both ends. And you know, their rebounding advantage has been glaring, simply outworking them on the boards for that entire first quarter. Setting the floor for the Bucks. Brooke Lopez is out there with Jay Crump. Then it's Matthews, then it's Holiday, and it's Ingles in at the three. And this is the way to stretch the floor. PG-13 with a good look from the corner. And he nails it. That's good. And it's Jackson with the assist that time. George has got five points in the quarter. That's a foul called on Shea Gilgis Alexander. That's his first foul. Jokic has checked in for Sabonis. The Bucks also in the sub. Middleton's checked in. There's 126 left in the first half. Shoots the three. Gets the three-pointer to fall. Middleton's got himself on the board with three there. Well, there's a good reason this guy shoots as many threes as he does. Chris Middleton is a knockdown three-point shooter. Morant passes to Jackson. And here's George for three. He makes another one. That's four up and four in to start his game. The real come at us, and we're coming right back at you. A little back and forth from long range. I love it. That's a terrific answer there. The shot by Holiday, no good. The West leading by six. The pass to Jokic over Lopez. And it's Jokic missing. Boy, he's got to be kicking himself for failing to make that shot. That's money. Matthews passes to Middleton. That one falls. His second basket of the game. He's now two for three. That's just what we call man up strength from Middleton. I mean, taking the hit and then kind of effortlessly knocking down the shot as well. And that one, good. There's PG creating for a teammate. Terrific dime drop. Bucks trail by six. Middleton outside. There's 10 seconds left in the first half of basketball. Six on the shot clock. Paul George. For Milwaukee, they have been perfect at the line so far, albeit just two for two. And taking a look at their free throw statistics on the season, uh, right around 74%. You know, the numbers from the line, guys, are close to where they were last year. Uh, but just a tad worse, so not too bad. Middleton hits them both. And what an advantage. You really feel like you can always trust him when he's at the line. Lillard outside. And oh, he hits the buzzer, Peter. One eye on the rim, one eye on the clock. Nice job. What was really impressive there, though, guys, was that he could have rushed it and panicked, and yet he kept his cool and splashed it. And so it's the West All-Stars with a six-point lead at the end of the quarter. They're shooting the ball so well in this one. A great performance from the field. Back. We've got second half action for you. Thus far, a pretty evenly contested game. It's been one outstanding game from George. You just love the patience in that first half. Waited until he got the look he wanted. Well, you know what, guys? It was all about efficient offense, not rushing things. Taking your time, finding the best shot on every possession. And as we get into this third quarter, as we've seen so far, neither team able to create much separation on the scoreboard yet. 
That'll be a five-second call. Bucks ball. Holiday against Kirk. Holiday, the pass to Giannis. The kick out to Holiday. And the three off target. The West leading by six. We've got Stephen Curry. Jokic is out there with Zion Williamson. Then there's Doncic. And it's James in at the small forward. That's the five for the West All Stars right now. Williamson, good, and the assist goes to James. Williams, who's got the opening bucket to start the second half for the West All-Stars. And here's Middleton bringing it up now for Milwaukee. Pass to Holiday. Let's it go from 14. Here's Lopez. Doesn't go for him. James with some nice D. 105 left in the third. On deep. Kept alive. Here's Jokic. Another shot. Again, the West All-Star. And that's a sweet dime from Jokic. He's always had good vision, and it only seems to get better every year. And Holiday kicks to Giannis. To the paint. And onto the Kumbo. Slams it in. Terrific accuracy on that pass. That's how you lead your teammate. The West leading by eight. LeBron dishes to Curry over Holiday, and there's Stephen Curry on the assist by James. You know, I think the passing skills of LeBron are his greatest asset, and he's got some great ones in addition to that. But his passing is other world. When you get open, he gets it to you with exactly the right speed and pace so you can handle it. So the West ends up going with the new group. Big group substitution here for Milwaukee. Crowder, he's checked in for Lopez. Joe Ingles comes in for Chris Middleton. Pat Connaughton, he's checked in for Grayson Allen. And it's Carter in for Drew Holiday. Passes it to Connaughton. Nice ball movement by Milwaukee. And the Bucks miss again. And he rushed that one, no doubt about it. The D out of position, you could see the frustration on his face. Yep, that one goes in there. George has got the lead at the 12 now for the West All-Stars. Now, here's Anadokounmpo. He's got eight. Ingles in the corner. Front past the arc. No good that time. And so it's the West All-Star. Enjoying a 12-point lead as they talk things over during the break. And it's been their rugged defense setting the tone. Don't go anywhere. We'll be right back. And how about a look now at our assist of the game? Brought to you by State Farm. And definitely deserving of the prize tonight. How about the read he made here? Looking like a point guard with the pass right on the money. Terrific versatility coming from a big man. Not something that the majority of big guys possess. And with the fourth quarter upon us, time is running out for this game to become competitive. Bucks trail by 12, and the whistle blows. It's going to be on John Morant. That is his first foul of the game. The Bucks making a change here. So with Holiday sitting on the bench, this is Mike Budenholzer's lineup. Giannis and Lopez hold down the post for him. Then there's Carter. Then there's Pat Connaughton. And it's Bochamp in at the two. Jokic, one of my favorite bigs to watch. So crafty, light on his feet. He gets the jump on the defense with that pull-up shot of his. And there's the whistle. Three-second violation. And just a little too lax with that possession. And it costs us. And I tell you what, more brain-neutral plays like that one, and they'll have a hole deeper than the one they're already in. Looking at who's out there now for the Bucks. Allen comes in for Pat Connaughton. And it's Holiday in for Carter. Jokic inside. Lopez covering. Jokic passes to LeBron. Good, and the assist goes to Jokic. Jokic has got three assists in the game. Morant against Holiday. Allen for the three. 
And it's Jokic with the rebound. The West leading by 16. Inside. The shot's good from LeBron. They maintained focus all night and, and along the way put on quite a show. And, you know, everybody in the building knows this is a wrap, a done deal. Put this one in the W column. Here's onto Takubo. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at LeBron the free throw line. First personal foul. That's on LeBron James. And, you know, at almost seven feet tall, Shooting Anta Tukumpo is, is dangerous down inside, really. I mean, the defense has to be physical with him if they want to have a chance at preventing him from scoring in the paint. That's good from Anta Tukumpo. The West All-Stars making a switch here. Lillard's checked in, and then for Milwaukee, Crowder comes in for Brooke Lopez. And Marcelli Matthews subbed in for Drew Holiday. That one falls, so he hits both of them. There's 57 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Good on the shot. And the West leads by 18. Saw the opportunity to put this away and did not turn it down. And, you know, this run shows what kind of attitude this team has. I mean, the win is there. Go get it. And the rejection by Andekumbo. Uh, you know, he's almost the perfect defensive player. He's got length and strength, and he's athletic, and... Giannis plays the game hard all the time, too, which is impressive. And so, onto the Kumba will bring it up for the Bucks. Over in the corner, Matthews. Misses the three. Here's West now. Big stretch here going 10-2. Just two seconds between shot clock and game. Out of bounds. Milwaukee takes possession. All goes to the into the lineup for the Bucks, Javon Parker. Fifteen seconds left in the fourth quarter of this one. Now, Andre Kumbo. And Jaron Jackson picks up the foul. That's his first foul of the game, and the bonus will go to the free throw line. Team foul. Yeah. That's a bad move there. Stops the clock and puts the other side on the line. Yeah, inexcusable. I mean, he's got to know not to take any chances there. That's just a terrible That's foul. The line for the box. Giannis Adetokounmpo. Two shots. The first free throw is good. Good on both. So no problem for the West All-Stars as they get the win. This game may not have been the most exciting we've ever seen, but you have to appreciate just what a clinical performance they put on. I know their fans appreciated it, and we saw at times just stretches of excellent defense. Potency from an offensive standpoint as well. They, they were pretty much dominant. And that'll wrap it up, folks. For Greg Anthony, Clark Kellogg, and David Aldridge, this is Kevin Harlan. Thanks for watching the NBA on 2K Sports.